Alrighty guys, welcome back to Super Mega Baseball. It is episode 3, and these 0-2 B-Wolves need to get something going. Today they take on the 0-2 Moonstars, both teams desperate for their first victory. I have added some more trainers and whatnot. Not since last episode though, you didn't miss anything, but I've done a little bit to make these players better, and we're going to see if it helps make a difference, because we need to start winning these games. Lance Adams had a tremendous episode last time around, and we'll see if he helps us out again as Logan Cannon makes his first start. Now, I'm going to edit this lineup a little bit. I'm going to move Boyd down in the order, and we're going to move... Who do I want batting second? I think third or fourth is a good spot for Lance. So we're going to put Darren Rose. We're going to move him all the way up. He's earned it. And we're going to let... Man, we just need some more contact on this team. We're going to push up Corey Boyd to fifth. All right. This is the winning lineup today. Let's go. And we are underway. B-Wolves and the Moonstars. We're leading things off. These terrible uniforms are gracing us with their presence once again. Couldn't score on them the first time. Oh my god, this guy's name is Elmo Slayer. Are you kidding me? No, you gotta stop pitching or at least keep missing. Elmo Slayer is this guy's name. All he's doing right now is throwing balls. There he goes. There's the first strike. There's he evens the or he uh, makes the count full. Ball four! Didn't swing once. Jonathan Starks go to first base. Elmo Slayer. Not doing uh himself any favors here early on. There's ball one. Liking this start though. One and one to Darren Rose. That one is fouled off. A little late swing that time. Maybe a little hit and run. Oh, swung through it. Oh, I think I screwed up anyway. I didn't steal. All right, so a strikeout for Rose and now Lance Adams. He got the home run last time. Our only runs have come on that hit. First strike to Lance. Second strike to Lance. Wow. And now down the middle. Come on, it got past the shortstop. Go to third, Starks. Oh, no, Pickle. Get back to second. If I was not hesitating there, maybe he gets there. But two on, one out for Dominic Carter. Oh, that's inside and terrible. Oh, that was a really nice pitch. This guy's ratings, by the way, are very, very good. He's a third pitcher. They must be a really good pitching team as that one goes to right center and will not fall in. Those guys made it like all the way to the next base. I thought they were just assuming that it would drop, but it didn't. So two on, two out for Corey Boyd. Back up the middle. Go home, Jonathan. Starks rounds third. And he goes home. We have a run on something other than a home run. We scored in the first inning. What a game this is. Leon Daniels now with two on and two out. Wait a minute. These are different unis. They're not like the dark green. These are actually awesome. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention earlier. These uniforms are good. Leon now evens the count with that miss. Two and two. Oh, come on. High and inside. But it's one nothing. I'm super excited about that. And now the lefty, Logan Cannon, starts his journey here in Super Mega Baseball by getting that pop out to Jonathan Starks. And now, Clyde Oliver. Oliver grounds this one down first base. Scooped up by Dominic Carter. We have two down early on here. As Rusty Bustum looks at a strike. That's a terrible pitch. And back up the middle. It gets sent to center. So, they have a two-out single. Herbert Hackman. Home run on the season. He's batting 300. He fouls off the first pitch and puts this one deep in right center. Boyd going back. We all know he's slow. It's off the wall. Can Boyd get it back into the infield? That's going to be a run and a triple as they even the score. Well, that sure took the wind out of my sails as Windy Wheels makes her first appearance. And that is a pop-up to center. And that is a catch for Flash Jackson. So one apiece through one inning. And Elmo Slayer had 23 pitches in that first inning. Now the second. 
Good pitch. Should have swung. 0-1 to Flash. That's inside at least. Come on, Flash. Oh, come on. That was a nice little pitch, though. That one's outside. At least we're working the count. Stamina already taking a noticeable dent. 3-2. and two. Inside. Had to swing at it, though. I thought it was in the zone. And that will not drop in. Weekly hit. Pop out. As Maurice Manning is in the box. Oh, come on. Bat's not long enough to hit it that far of the plate. That's my excuse. Two strikes. And there it is again. See? Like... That's still like a strike, but the bat's too short. That's a problem. Logan Cannon pitches left but hits right. And Cannon goes back to the pitcher, and that was quite the quick inning. So Logan Cannon had seven pitches in his first inning. Still allowed a run on there. And come on. Get there, Manning. Nice. No, the throw was terrible. That was my bad. Rodney Park now. Okay, ground ball. This one's going to make up for it, maybe. No, we can't turn two. What's Parker's speed? As Lars Stadcleef. I'm not sure if there's a silent letter in there. Maybe double silent letters. That'd be amazing. But he grounds back to the pitcher. He ain't fast. Double play. That was a quick one. Fastest inning we've ever seen, probably. As Stark says his second plate appearance. He walked in the first inning. And now he goes up the middle. It's stopped by the second baseman who throws out Starks. Still trying to get on base. Here comes Darren Rose hitting 286. Outside. Don't sneak a strike in there. Oh, wow. That was actually pretty fast. Oh, come on. Don't change speeds like that. Weekly hit. Can, le can Rose leg it out? Not even close. All right, Lance. Hitting 714 on the season. Lance Adams swings too early. Come on now. And that one's inside, although I would have agreed that probably was a strike. And now ripping that one foul. One and two. Come on, Lance. He got underneath it maybe a little too much. Lifted to left center. Playable. Caught. Two down. Oh, three down. That was this is going by so quickly. First inning took a while, and now we're just all of a sudden playing the game and fast forward. Oh, popped him up again. Leon Daniels gets underneath it. Two outs. Clyde Oliver. Nice play. That's another quick half inning. Into the fourth we go with Dominic Carter leading things off. I think he had a well hit out earlier. Hey, there we go. The power to left field. He goes the other way. And it's, oh, come on. They robbed the home run. I know he dropped it, but it's just a double now. That's disappointing. But Carter's on second to start the inning. Now, Corey Boyd, I always swing at the first terrible pitch I see. And then I take a strike that's, you know, on the fringe. But Boyd back up the middle. That's going to at least advance Carter. So a man on third. One out. Got to bring him home, Leon. Leon's first RBI opportunity. Whoa! That was high. One strike. Two strikes. Come on, Leon. Don't let me down. Leon Daniels grounds the third. He can't play it cleanly. I'm not sure that's considered an RBI, is it? I guess it could be. Probably. So, we're going to call it an RBI right now for Leon Daniels. Flash Jackson up with two outs. He pops it up, but at least we take the lead in this inning. Thanks to Leon. No, not thanks to Leon. Thanks to Dominic Carter. He got himself in position. So, 2-1 to one in the fourth inning. Shallow pop up to left. Playable for Lance, who I actually over-pursued. And then he, over, he corrects it for me. Here's Herbert Hackman. He had that triple earlier. Maybe we'll be a little bit more careful this time as that's fielded by Rose. Weak throw is still there. Look at Peyton Manning throw there as that pitch is fouled off. And that might get through, but not with Manning there. Perfect throw. Ah, the stop won't matter. That was fast. Decent speed on first base. As swing and a miss to start this at bat. There's a hit. 
to Starks, and that's a line out. Let's go to the fifth inning. We've actually scored in two separate innings. Quite the progress we're making today. Oh, a little ahead of it. That would have been a nice hit. Too high. Not swinging that time. Too low. Two and one to Mo Manning. And Mo Manning grounds it to second. That's the first out of the inning. Logan Cannon. Can we get a pitcher hit here? Help your own cause, Logan. That is not helping your own cause, although you're helping my cause in the effort to earn star points. Fly out. Jonathan Starks. Doesn't have a hit on the season. Come on, Jonathan. No, that's not going to work for me. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Paint in the corner. That's a ball, though. One and two. And Starks. That might bloop in. It might bloop in. Just kidding. Great. Another one, two, three inning. Now we're up against Rodney Park. Anticipated it. Throw is there, out number one. Now, it's going to start to become an issue as we get another out. But the bullpen, obviously there are only three members of the bullpen. And I just used two last games. So I wonder how stamina is going to play a factor as these games progress. And players just play more often. Wow, what a strikeout. That guy, what is... He's crying. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be mean. But, I mean, that was awful. So, Darren Rose leads this one up. And there's that pop-up once again. Man, they just pitch too high. Pitch lower for a change. As Lance Adams takes his place in the box. Lance Adams rips it up the middle for another base hit. Lance is quite uh, the player for us. Now Dominic Carter. Lefty versus lefty and a swing and a miss. That's outside. You see Dominic Carter has that bat. That's just shorter than everybody else is but line out. Hit that one at least with good contact. Here's Corey Boyd. Boyd trying to do something here with two down. He's going to drive it to right. And that's caught. So Lance Adams... Doesn't get past first base. Bottom of the sixth now. Ground ball back to Logan Cannon. Now we've gotten good outings from all three of our starting pitchers. Come on. Oh, come on. Couldn't get it. Starks can't play it cleanly, but he recovers and makes a great throw. Two down. But this is about the range we're in the first two games. Teams finally got something on us. We made it through six cleanly. We've gotten four hits on Elmo Slayer. And now Leon Daniels at bat. Already, it seems too early. Looking at strike one. See, one way or another, as Leon Daniels rips it to left, that's like his first hit, I think. But I keep starting these at bats by falling behind. I gotta change that. So at bat now is Bert Bergerer. And he's got velocity. Facing Flash Jackson, who's apparently... Is Flash a switch hitter? Is he always lefty? That's weird. Pop up from Flash. Just go back to first, Leon. Another disappointment. Flash Jackson batting a very realistic uh, average, it looks like, compared to his Road to the Show series, although it might be even lower. Maurice Manning now at bat. Wow. Didn't look like 69 power to me. As that's a weekly hit ground out. And now Logan Cannon. We're going to keep him in there. Leon Daniels in the scoring position. What can Logan Cannon do? Cannon grounds it. Come on. Take a while to get it. But Cannon can't get there. Unable to add any more runs. It's 2-1. to one. I put a lot of high scoring games on here. But these season games. I'm telling you guys. We're playing sim baseball in this series it seems. One down. Windy wheels. With the speed. I think I called Windy a girl earlier. My bad. As Windy drives it to center. And I got underneath it nicely with Flash Jackson. So Lackey Luster. With a Lackey Luster hit to the pitcher. One, two, three inning. So Jonathan Starks. Hitless on the season. But he has that contact and speed. He's got to make use of it sometime. Starks to center. 
It has not enough carry. It's just a nice little loud out. As Rose is now at bat. Come on, Darren. He rips it. Kinda. Didn't really rip it that hard, but he's gonna get on base. Rose might have earned the leadoff spot until Starks can get his stuff together. Here's Lance Adams now. Two for three on the day. Lance! Oh my god! He drove that one out of the state. Or country. I'm not sure where we are. And there's another hit for Lance Adams. I can hit with him, no problem. Wow. Three hit game for Lance Adams. Two on, one out for Dominic Carter. And Carter bounces it off the pitcher who's there to cover. That was heads up. He just got doinked, but still had the presence of mind to get to first base. So two on, two out, both in scoring position. Corey Boyd swings and misses. Oh, I wanted to bring in Pratt. Not going to happen. Two strikes. I can't do that to him. Extreme pressure as he swings through it and misses. Might have been a little high. Wow, there's a missed opportunity. All right. We're already in the eighth inning. This one's flying by. Get there, Lance. Come on, Lance. Nice play. Lars Stark de Cleef. I'm not sure what that origin is. Maurice Manning handles the second pop out. Now Burt Berger. Logan Cannon deals. That is a hit to short. Eight scoreless innings. All right. Leon Daniels is at bat. He's hitting 111 on the season. Daniels starts the ninth. We're looking for an insurance run. Not going to get it with a pop out. Nope. All right, one down. Who now? Flash Jack. So we're going to call on a pinch hitter. We're going to bring in Eric Carter. I know his ratings are awful, but you know what? I want to see someone else. Eric Carter's at bat now. First at bat of the season. He looks at strike one. Eric Carter's confident, though, but that confidence won't amount to much. Grounding out too short. Maurice Manning now at bat. Two outs in the inning. And Manning goes inside out to foul that one off. And now swinging through that awful pitch. And that one as well. Thought I could at least hit this one. So Manning's crying, but he has to wipe the tears and get back out there. And we're keeping Logan Cannon on the mound. He's going for a complete game. It's 2-1. to one. And I think at one point I called this, uh, like, eight scoreless innings. I screwed up. My bad. And come on! Caught by Starks. I just want to keep the bullpen rested is all. Here's Clyde Oliver. Oliver grounds it foul. Boy, am I going to look like an idiot, though, if we blow this. Foul. Get there, Leon. You can catch up to it if you believe you can achieve. Come on. Two strikes and a swing and a miss. Strike three. All right. Can we end this game right here for win number one? The outside pitch is driven to center. It backs up Eric Carter who makes the catch. Game over. That was a quick one. The B-Wolves win 2-1 to one, their first win of the season against the winless Moonstars. It was an exciting start to the game, but not much else happened. They had, we had seven hits and they had four. Sim baseball, guys. Two Sim, maybe. We struck out five times in this game. Nine innings from Logan Cannon, only one earned run. Two strikeouts, so he pitches the contact and gets a complete game, one run performance. Well done. Logan Cannon is the player of the game, but Lance Adams deserves his place up here. That win. All right, complete game win bonus, victory bonus. What level am I now? That's got to be higher than four, though. Huh. It never goes any higher. So we've unlocked new player modifiers. The gold chain meditation and the red meat diet. Which helps your arm but hurts your speed. We've unlocked some new slots for players. Two for Cannon and one for Darren Rose. Both of which played well in this game. I like how that works. All right, we have four games to simulate until our next one. But thank you all for watching this episode. I'm happy we finally got a victory. And we'll see what 
is in store as we move on. But thank you all again for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed. Comment below any feedback you have and hit that subscribe button. We are now 1 and 2. Still not in a great spot. And we'll see who we play next and what their record's going to be. And we'll check some stats too. So stick around for a minute or two, whatever's left in the video. So that is the end of the simulation. Check out our schedule. We play against the Crocodons next time, and they're 2 and 1. But let's look at some stats. Three games into the season in a 16 game year. Here are the numbers Lance Adams batting 700, 7 hits, and 10 at bats. League leaders now. Lance Adams is second in average. Nobody else is on the list here for either of these things. On base, good for Lance. Slugging is good. On base plus slugging is good. Hits, Lance. Extra base hits, Lance. Let's see. Uh, caught stealing. There's Leon Daniels. Along with Jonathan Starks. Pitching. Alright, one win for everybody. No one's had a uh, pitcher start two games yet. ERA is good for Logan Cannon, but plenty of shutouts it looks like. And then one save. Good whip, Andy and Logan. Good stuff here. I like this. This is a lot of fun, guys. Thank you all for supporting this series. I'm having a great time with it. I'm excited to continue into part four. That's it for today. Have a great day, guys. I'll see you next time.